Vladislav Davidson. I'm a tech executive with 20 years in startups as founder. Before moving here two months ago, I literally took the Berkeley health officer in Berkeley to court over these health orders. I'm now here and I'm digging in for the most important fight of my life thus far, the fight for our freedom and our values as Americans. And yes, that absolutely includes our capitalist economy. Free markets, our democracy and freedom are inherently intertwined. I am the cause for your inboxes to flood with over a thousand emails in the last 48 hours from your constituents. That's over a thousand people asking you to do the same thing as Atwater and Imperial have done by saving our jobs and our freedom. Why in the world are you turning over our small businesses to Amazon and big box stores over a fear of a flu bug, according to CDC, with a 99.6% survival rate and a 99.9% .9 survival rate below age of 70? Why? Since when do Republicans surrender essential liberty for temporary security and a bit of state cash? What the hell happened to you people and your values? Now, if the thousand messages you received from your constituents through my petition were not clear, let me repeat this for you. You must reopen the county for business immediately. You have the power to do so, and we are demanding you simply copy paste the same actions taken by the cities of Atwater and the cities of Imperial and declare us a business sanctuary. So I encourage you to take a deep breath and ask yourself, what are your values? What do you stand for? Because the bottom line here is very simple. Either you're going to reopen this county for business and uphold the Constitution, or people like myself are going to do this for you. If you, pale, if you fail to pass the business sanctuary ordinance, I am going to get the signatures necessary to force a special election. And we will force a special election and reopen this county without you. Let me be very clear. This is happening one way or another. I've got a 20 year professional track record of winning at absolutely any cost. And I view this fight as the most important one of my life thus far. Because this is a fight for America, for freedom, for capitalism, and for our way of life. As Ronald Reagan once put it, this is the last stand on earth for freedom. If we lose it here, there is nowhere else to go. As a first generation immigrant, I know firsthand that once we surrender our freedoms, it'll be, it'll be hell and blood to get them back. Not on my watch, not with my consent, will you destroy the capitalist economy and our freedom. Either you will reopen this county or we are going to do your job for you by amplifying the voices of tens of thousands of your constituents and we'll force a special election and we will reopen this county and then ensure your defeat at the next election. We're not messing around. Let me be very clear about that, folks. Very clear. Your choice. So I close today by asking a simple question. I'm not done yet. So I close today by asking a simple question. Since when does the most badass nation on earth run from bugs? Since when do Republicans surrender freedom for the same temporary security and some government cash? How did you become so cowardly as to cross this line of treason to your oath of office? At which point will you respect the will of your constituents and take a stand for courage and moral righteousness? Do the right thing. Reopen this county. Thank you.